So Marquette is taking on Vermont Friday night, and Vermont is a solid 15 seed. Uh, they have some solid guard play. They're well coached. They won't beat themselves. And between Dylan Penn and American East player of the year, Finn Sullivan, uh, they have some solid pieces. Um, but ultimately, I don't think they match up well with Marquette. And the biggest weakness, I think, for Vermont is their pick-and-roll defense. Uh, between Tyler Kolick, uh, the point guard, and big man Oso Igadaro, who is super mobile, can catch lobs from Kolick all day, lengthy guy, uh, I think Vermont's going to have a tough time guarding the pick-and-roll. Uh, Marquette is fifth in the country in two-point field goal percentage and fourth in the country in assists. And you're going to see a lot of that in the pick-and-roll. Marquette converts their uh, – baskets around the rim at an extremely high rate obviously and uh vermont's big man is matt Verretto. uh fun fact about him he started his career in 2018-19 at delaware then transferred to uconn as a regular student completed his undergrad and now this is his first year back playing collegiate basketball since 2018-19 and he's more of a skilled like three-point spot shooter uh and he's tasked with guarding igadaro uh something tells me shock is gonna have marquette going right after him all the time in the pick and roll. Um, and Marquette's not a good rebounding team. They're 317th in the country. But Vermont is even worse. They're 337th in the country, and they're doing that against mid-major competition. So Vermont has their work cut out for them. I think they can keep it competitive for a while if things go right for them. But ultimately, Mar Marquette's size, length, athleticism, pressure, it's going to be too much for them in the end. So I don't expect Vermont to be the next 15 seed to knock off a two. The matchup is just not a good matchup size-wise for Vermont. Um, so, yeah. That's all I got for you. I'm taking Marquette pretty easily in this one. Uh, and this is your first video with me. Thank you for making it to the end of the video. Uh, I'll be doing a lot more March Madness content, so make sure you hit that subscribe button for more college basketball content, and I'll see you next time.